We're in the city of Mississauga. This is the little native hockey league tournament that's put on every year uh, by the little NHL uh, committee. We have uh, close to 200 teams, close to 3,000 kids that come out, all First Nations uh, within Ontario. Some communities are, are very far north though and uh, uh, fly in communities that uh, don't get a chance uh, to, to play the sport as regular as, as other communities. Uh, you know, some communities, their kids and their parents, uh, it, it took them two, three days just to get here. I think it's very important because, you know, a lot of First Nations youth don't even have, uh, you know, a lot of the communities up north don't even have, like, a regular season league to play in. So, you know, we're all looking forward to this all year long. Why have a league specifically like this? There was a lot of racism, uh, you know, back in the 70s, uh, you know, uh, more than there is today. And it was a place where uh, you really felt comfortable in your own skin. Uh, you felt like you belonged there. Um, unlike, you know, the, the regular minor hockey league where you always felt, you know, that you were uh, the odd, uh, the oddball in the room and uh, you just didn't fit in. This created a, an environment where uh, you, you felt welcome and you felt that you, you belong there. And uh, this is why we continue this, to provide that safe space for our kids. I want to show the world that it's still going on and they want to stop it. Do you feel proud playing in this league? Oh yeah, I feel really proud. It's very fun. This era of truth and reconciliation and uh, uh, people understanding and appreciating uh, Indigenous culture. Uh, but there still is uh, a, a lot of racism uh, that's uh, remained in and off the ice that uh, our, our kids and uh, uh, Indigenous people in general uh, are faced with. And what do they get out of this tournament other than have some fun hockey? Well, they get uh, to feel proud about who they are and uh, pride in their culture and they get to make new friends and uh, that'll last a lifetime and an experience that they'll never forget. It means representing our community, uh, you know, representing our the ones before us, our parents, our grandparents, and it's just a lot of fun. Close to 500 games will be played in this tournament. That wraps up on Thursday. In Mississauga, Audra Brown, City News.